the whole genesis uh, behind the Allies Alliance project uh, really started at the end of January of 2011, which was just shy of a couple of months after my wife passed. Uh, I was I found myself sitting in the dark, empty house and, and realizing that my kids were gone and the grandkids were out there, but there really was nothing left for me. Uh, everything that I had, everything that was about my life, uh, was wrapped up in Allison, and uh, and that was gone. And uh, I, I was in a lot of pain. I was in a lot of a lot of discomfort about the whole thing, and and trying to find a reason for for hanging in there, uh, quite frankly. And uh, and what came to me was was that if I could uh, if I could do something that would help another family uh, dealing with cancer, if I could do something that would help uh, somebody else not go through. Uh, what I was going through, then that would be a, a really worthwhile thing to do. And, uh, uh, and so as, as I thought about it, I thought about the different stages of what Allison and I had gone through, and, and I realized that there really was the shock of the diagnosis, you know, when we first got the news. Uh, there was the ongoing battle that, that, that took place over about 11 months, and then finally where I was at at that time, which was the, the bereavement or the aftermath. Uh, part of things, and and I thought that during that year or during that uh, almost a year, that uh, I had learned about so many resources in my community that were there to help uh, cancer victims, uh, their families, the caregivers, that nobody ever really found unless somebody put a phone number in their hand or or uh, or somebody gave them a website or or, or told them to contact an individual. Uh, in our community, there's resources uh, to help people pay their bills, but nobody knows about them until uh, until somebody gives you a phone number. Uh, they're, they're, when you first get the diagnosis and you're in that, that shocked phase of, of, of you know just realizing that that you're you're dealing with cancer, you don't know where to turn. You don't you don't really have any 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 clear cut uh, plan for what you're doing. So. Um, the whole point of Allies Alliance is to create a clearinghouse on the web, uh, a one-stop shop, if you will, where somebody can go uh, without any, any burden of logging in or creating accounts or anything else like that and simply put in where their zip code is, you know, where, where they're located physically in the country, uh, what uh, stage of the battle they're in, if appropriate, what kind of cancer they're dealing with, and uh, how far they can travel from home. And, and that really is all that they would have to put in there. Uh, and the, the website or the search engine would then re return back a list of the resources available in their community and the things that they could access. Uh, and that's the whole point, is really to bring the, the patients, the caregivers, the family members together with the uh, resources that they need to engage the battle with cancer. Uh, and that's the story behind Allies Alliance. That's what we're trying to do, is a, a nationwide clearinghouse website uh, for cancer patients, their families, and caregivers to find the resources that they need.